think at the bottom, I think we need to look at the platform that we have in place to actually deliver the services. And that's really your technology platform and the processes that are around it. Um, but for, for these days, I don't think that that's the biggest cause for concern. I think that there's advanced technology out there. It's, it's evolving all the time. It can do bigger and better things each, as each day goes by. Uh, what is important is to have the right people behind it that actually implement that and, and, and the right organisations behind it that, that, that know what they're doing around the development of the technology. But that is there, that can do the trick, there's, there's no need to worry about that. Um, at the next sort of level up, one needs to have the right governance structures in place. And it's important that those are not just, um, if you've got somebody that you're working with to deliver the services, then make sure that it's a joint team. It needs to be people who are involved both from a client side as well as a service provider side within that governance structure to make it happen. It doesn't work if they're separate and they're running their own separate sort of initiatives to actually bring about the change and, and, and implement the services. Um, we've talked about the strong leadership and that is absolutely imperative to have in place. Uh, we've seen cases where it's been strong in the beginning while we've got the project initialised and, and, and signed off uh, that leadership has then disappeared and it has led to endless problems downstreaming and actually driving it through. But So strong leadership is important all the way through to drive through the changes. And then I'd say that one of the most important things is the change management, um, which is not about just the technology and the process change, but more, most importantly about the people side of things. How do you get people to accept and adapt to using information that's flowing around electronically that's far more automated than the paper and, and the more hard sort of forms of, 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 of documentation, if you like, that they've been used to in the past that have probably been around for thousands of years now. That is a big cultural change from, from a hard form of communication to, to a softer form or the more electronic form or less tangible form, if you like.